The battle over TUSD Mexican-American studies could cross the line into crime, a death threat. But that claim brought two opponents together at TUSD headquarters today. As Craig Smith reports, the man who's done the most to shut down the Mexican-American studies program calmly shared a microphone with an advocate who has worked hard to preserve and revive it. Attorney General Tom Horn started off with a reminder. As state school superintendent, he wrote the law that prompted the TUSD board to shut down Mexican-American studies. I think it's a, it's a highly racist curriculum. U of A Mexican-American studies professor Dr. Roberto Rodriguez is working to restore the program to TUSD. He said that our, our um, curriculum is highly racist. You know, we live in a highly racist society. In a way, this man brought them together. He's Randall Leon Thompson. Dr. Rodriguez says Thompson made phone calls threatening to kill him. Thompson goes to trial next week on misdemeanor charges, but Rodriguez feels the case is really a hate crime. The charge against Thompson reflects bad behavior by Mexican-American studies opponents. Demonstrators for the program have kept a higher profile with demonstrations that disrupted board meetings. Horn complained some protests made him a special target. Now Horn and Rodriguez are calling for more civil discussion of the dispute. Rodriguez says some of those protests reflect frustration and are like civil rights protests back in history. Asked about protesters who have shown up at houses of school board members, he said he did not know the specifics. But I think in a general sense, obviously, we don't want Im intimidation of anyone. You know, I think if it's legal and if it's legitimate protest, then people shouldn't be prohibited from doing that. But if it, if it goes beyond, you know, what's legitimate and what's legal, and, and again, here's our top lawman, maybe he can tell us. Though both men said they would not debate Mexican-American studies, they each tried to make points for their viewpoint, perhaps Horn a bit more than Rodriguez. Sir, respectfully, I got to point out, you, you, you have kind of outlined your complaint against Mexican-American studies in the course of this news conference. Well, I could say a lot more, but the professor and I agreed that this was not the subject of our debate here. Craig Smith, KGON 9, on your side. Both Rodriguez and Horn would like U of A's Center for Civil Discourse to try to help reconcile all sides of the Mexican-American studies discussion. Dispute. TUSD issued a statement that cites threats made against both sides, demonstrations and visits to board members with what the statement calls intent to intimidate. It calls for more civility in the debate.